how to braid your hair. For braid number one, you're going to take some hair divided in three and take your outer strands and cross them under the one in the middle, like I'm doing here. Notice how I place my hand. I just pinch on the section that I'm adding hair to and then add the hair and cross it. Pinch add the hair that I want to add and cross it. And I'm doing the same thing over and over again, just adding some hair to the outer strand before I cross it under the one in the middle. With braids like this, it's always very important to bear in mind the position of our hands because it's what's going to make it easier for us to braid the hair. When you reach the neck area, there are no other sections for you to incorporate, so all you need to do is braid the rest of the hair down and tie it with a small elastic. Since we crossed our sections under each other instead of over each other, our hair looks a lot thicker. For braid number two, you're going to pick a little bit of hair, divide it in three, and cross your sections over the one in the middle instead of under. Notice that I cross my section first and add the hair later. Then I move on to the other side, cross my section, and add the hair. So I always cross the section first, add hair and then move on to the other side, cross the section and add hair. Once all the sections have been incorporated, you're going to reach the neck area and at this point, you're going to braid the rest of the hair down as you normally would. Tie it with a small elastic and that's it, you're done. This braid is gorgeous, however, it looks a little flatter than the previous one. But if you want more volume, you can always pinch it a little. For this braid, take a section of hair, divide it in two, and then take a little piece of hair from one of the strands and bring it to the opposite side. Again, take a little piece from the extreme, bring it to the other side, and notice we're always working with two main strands. Now I'm gonna take a little piece of hair from the extreme, add hair to it, and cross it over that section to bring it to the opposite side. Now you must repeat the same steps on the other side. Take a little piece of hair from the extreme, hold it with your hand, add hair to it, and then cross it over that strand to bring it to the opposite side. I'm going to give you a useful tip. It's a lot better to hold your braid with your thumb, cross your section first, and then add the hair to it. Check it out, I'm going to hold the braid with my thumb, take a little piece of hair from the extreme and cross it, and now incorporate some hair to it. That way it is a lot easier to braid your hair and your braid will look tight. From here on, we're just going to pick little pieces of hair from each of the sections and bring them to the opposite side. Tie your hair with an elastic and that's it. This braid is a little bit more time consuming, but it looks super intricate and beautiful. For braid number four, you're going to take a piece of hair, divide it in two, cross your sections, and then add hair to one of the sections first, hold it, and then add hair to the other section as well. Now twist both of your sections and bring one over the other. Let's see this one more time. Add hair to the section on the right, then add hair to the section on the left. Twist both sections, and then cross them, the right one over the left one. When you reach this point, you're going to twist your sections and cross them over each other, as I'm doing here. It needs to be super tight before you tie it with a small elastic, otherwise it won't look good. And that's it. Divide your hair in four different sections. Take the outer section and cross it over, under, Leave it there and pick the outer section on the opposite side and it comes under and over. The outer section on the right goes over and under. And now the outer section on the left goes under and over. It's not that difficult, you just need to repeat the same steps over and over again until you reach the end and then tie your hair with an elastic. And this is how it looks. For braid number six, divide your hair in four strands. Take the outer strand and just cross it over and under. Take the outer strand on the left and bring it under and over. Take the outer section on the right and cross it over. Now you're going to add hair to it and then you're going to cross it under. Leave it there, take the outer section on the left and bring it under, add hair to it. And now you're going to take your section and bring it 
over the following one. This braid is pretty much the same as number five, but you're adding hair to the outer strands when you're crossing them. And remember that the most important thing when trying to master a braid is the position of your hands. And that's it, this is the final look. That's it for today's video, I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and leave your comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and on my website www.patrickjordan.com. Share the love with your friends and see you soon.